Welcome back to Sumster Games, the place to find new strategy games. And today we're going to play a game called Newton's Cradle Puzzle Game. Now, this is a very interesting puzzle game, but I want to tell you in advance that this is going to be a very short video because I am not good at this game. I can only solve the first four levels and there are no hints, so there's no way for me to figure out how to do the future ones. So I'll show you the first four levels and those of you who are actually good at solving puzzles might like this game and be able to do more. So let's go and play it. We're gonna pick level number one, which is over here. Now the way this works is that you have this ball here and you can put it, uh, move it in any direction. So we're gonna move it to the right and it's going to move it until it hits a wall. So we're gonna go down to the left and then back up. And our goal is to connect this big black ball with this tiny one. So let's do it. So this is pretty easy, right? You can also have multiple balls. And the way this works is that if a ball hits another ball, it will stop, but the other ball will continue in that direction. So this was also pretty easy. Now this one is a bit more interesting. Essentially what you do is you're gonna move the stuff around. So we're gonna move like this. We're gonna finish up over there. And then we're going to move. Yeah, actually we did this wrong. Okay, so actually this was a mistake because right now if I move there and move up, there's no way for me to get this ball into here. So we actually made a mistake here. So we gotta do it differently. Instead, what you gotta do is you gotta move up here first and then you're gonna move to the right with the ball on the left, which will automatically move the ball on the right to the end. And then you're gonna move upwards. See? Now this is level four, okay? Level four, this one is supposed to be easy. Okay, so we're gonna try this off. So first thing we gotta do is we gotta go up. Now this, uh, this last ball should be pretty easy because it's always easy to go towards the end. So we're gonna move like this, then move down. Then we're going to move in the middle and this way so that we can get rid of this particular ball. Now we gotta figure out a way to get to here for which you could, for example, do if we grab two, two of these. So that's good. And now, no, that wasn't the right. I, I know how to solve this one. I solved it. I just don't quite remember right this second how it went. I think we went, yeah, I think we went up first, then like this to get rid of this one, because this one is fairly difficult to get to. And then we got to figure out a way to get to the middle. Yes, which I think was like this. Yeah, and now we're gonna go down, we're gonna go to the right, we're gonna go down again, and now we're gonna finish it over here. So you can see this one actually took a lot more thinking. Now level five, I'll be honest with you, I actually don't know how to solve it. So we're gonna give me three attempts and if I don't solve it, then that's it, okay? But it seems like it should be easy, like, right? cause you only got four balls. And the thing is, if in any way I move to the right, automatically one of these will move to this and finish it. Which is not bad, but I think, let's let's try to go up first. How do we get to, no, actually that's gonna be wrong, right? So the thing is, how do we get to these two, two positions, right? Because I can go up, but I need something to stop a ball right here. So let's try to go like this. And then we could go up with both of these, but we have no way of getting towards this one right in, into the middle, which is, which is a bit of a problem. So so let's try to go up to the right. Yeah. Okay, we, we gotta try to like this. Let's go up. Okay, so this is like a million attempts later and I solved it, I can't believe it's all. Okay, so you have to go to the left with this one. Then you move them both together and you won. Ah, it was actually kind of easy, but I just like, I couldn't figure it out. I will try one more. It took me like 15 attempts, but you know what? Nobody asked. Nobody asked how many attempts it took, okay? I think we gotta go get two up top here to get one down there. So let's get, give that a shot. If I move you like that, and I move you like this, and then I move you to the right, you to the left like that. Wow, this was on the first attempt, okay? I'm getting so good at this game. What is this? Hello. Oh, I need to get the, 
the small one to the right and the ah oh, I see okay well that's actually oh so so the hollow one cannot move by itself well that's how am I supposed to move this one then that's a bit difficult what the hollow one cannot move by itself. But you can push it into the hole. How am I supposed to with the one tiny thing to get up there? I can't do that. That's weird. Oh, I see. Okay. <laughs> that might have been slightly embarrassing, but okay. You know, I think on that somewhat embarrassing note, we're going to finish the episode because I really don't think I can solve many more. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this. And we're probably screaming the solutions at me like for a while. Um, and you can click on the right to watch some other puzzle games. I'll see you there. Bye bye.